While searching for signs of weaponized protomatter, one of our long-distance research probes made a most curious discovery. It found a Class M planet at the heart of the Gonkra Nebula. That's not the most exciting news, however. The probe detected the presence of sentient life on the planet. The biosigns were very similar to our own. It is possible that we have discovered a lost tribe of Lucari. We're going to investigate and we'd like some backup. The probe went offline rather suddenly after detecting the planet. These people might not be very friendly. Very little on this sector is known to us or our allies. We have recently established contact with the sector's most prominent inhabitants, the First Federation. They are somewhat enigmatic, but encouraging, especially where Tranya is concerned. I'm reading a group of starships out there. They're armed, shielded, and combat capable. Let's hope they're not hostile as well. As the ranking officer here, I believe you should be the first to initiate contact. Curious. Perhaps they might respond more favorably to a familiar face. May I open a channel? Unidentified vessels, this is Captain Kumarke of the LSS Rescava. I extend cordial greetings in the interest of establishing peaceful contact between us. I'm not certain. Wait, they're locking weapons! I don't understand! The Rescava did nothing to provoke this attack! <laughs> Vessels. This is Prime Minister Tulemon of the Kentari Union. I've ordered our forces to cease hostilities and ask you to do the same. There's been a grave misunderstanding. It is customary for us to discuss such grievances in person. Will you accept my invitation to parlay? The Kentari? They survived. Somehow they managed to survive the devastation of Kenta and make it here. Incredible. Historically, Kentari were quick to distrust and attack. It would seem that hasn't changed. We should be cautious. Despite that, I am ready to transport when you are. By the 14th sacred trees of Lucar. The Kentari destroyed one world with their toxic ways, and it seems they're well on their way to destroy another. Unbelievable. This Prime Minister has much to answer for. Where is she, by the way? And why are we meeting on the street? That Kentari on the street looks quite ill.
reading high levels of toxic chemical emissions in the area. They still use unregulated exhaust systems? Unbelievable. How peculiar. The doors here have built-in filtration systems. What's that machine off to the side? Some sort of miniature store? It's full of breathing aids. People poison the air here. Does that fluid look off to you? I've never seen this level of suffering. Oh, they pile the refuse in the streets. It's barbaric. There are still heat signatures on this junk. It was placed here recently. Kill the Lucari and her alien lackeys. hatred for Lucari still burns in the hearts of some Kentari, along with violent xenophobia. Hopefully their leadership is of a more diplomatic nature. The Capitol building is a short distance from here. Even here, the poor huddled in misery. What? Another attack? Inside. The Kantari have some explaining to do. Well, this place is a far cry from the smog and squalor we just left, isn't it? Welcome to New Kentar. I must apologize for the unfortunate incidents that have taken place. You have arrived during a period of social unrest for our people. I'm afraid so. The decline of our world has split the Kentari into two factions. The reformists, like myself, who wish to gradually change our way of life for the better. And the traditionalists, who cling tightly to the old ways and all of the destruction that comes with them. The Kentari who attacked you were traditionalist soldiers. They see you 
and especially the Lucari, as a threat to their existence. It's simple. Your kind are well-armed aliens from an advanced culture. To the Trads, you're hostile invaders. And the Lucari? Dangerous anarchists from our distant past, long thought exiled, now returned. And more dangerous than ever. The troubling part is they may be right about all of you. Minister Pentaro is in charge of planetary security. It's his job to evaluate all potential threats, foreign and domestic. The idea of working with aliens, with Lucari, will be controversial. That said, our situation is deteriorating. I'm willing to open a dialogue with outside parties. Such a dialogue will be monitored, however, in the interest of planetary security. Your suspicion is misplaced, Minister. We had nothing to do with all this. You're not wrong, Captain. And we realize the need to do something about it. The privileged few are safe above the pollution, but they live on borrowed time. Ecosystems across the planet are failing. We can no longer afford to... Prime Minister, do you think it's prudent to discuss such matters with these outsiders? Curious. One band of aliens arrives with words of peace, while another arrives bearing the swords of war. How convenient. Coincidence? Or a cunning ruse to weaken our defenses and lower our guard? I believe you. Our moon is home to our agricultural sites and thousands of Kentari workers. Your help protecting it will be welcomed by my government. The sooner you can begin, the better. some trust with the Qatari. on the Kentari moon, along with numerous Zenkethi life signs and several protomatter signals. We'd better hurry. They may be preparing to detonate more bombs. Get to the moon and stop those bombs, now! I hope your people know how to deal with these bombs, Lucari. Some kind of trick.
detected some sort of intense energy detonation on the moon. We're reading zero life signs there. No one. They're all gone. What did they do to us? What has happened? All is not lost, Minister. While we can't bring back the Kentari who were killed, we can help you restore your moon's food production capabilities in short order. A likely story. For all we know, this is the precursor to invasion. These aliens have destroyed our food and weakened our military, Prime Minister. They mean to conquer us. Calm yourself, Pentaro, and remember who is Prime Minister here. Captain Kumarke, I accept your proposal. Provided there's full oversight from the Ministry of Defense at every stage of the operation. You'll understand our need for such security measures, I'm sure. I won't let you down, Prime Minister. Have your observation team meet mine on the moon at these coordinates. We'll begin as soon as we're able. are in place. The Matrix is stable and primed for effect. Let me know when you want me to initiate the restoration procedure. Protomatter Matrix is stable. We're ready to begin. Initiating primary restoration sequence now. Something is wrong. Everything just stopped. Why? Myself, that moon should be covered with crops by now. I could use some assistance down there. Please join me at the work site. All right, let's begin by configuring the flow regulators at each of the transmission arrays. I'll observe the flow rates while you make the adjustments. Curious. Someone made adjustments to the transmitters that could cause a detonation similar to a protomatter bomb. But whoever did it wasn't familiar with Lucari tech. We have safeguards to prevent such a thing, so instead of blowing up, it just didn't work. I hate to say it, but I believe one of the Kentari observers made those adjustments. I could use some assistance. I 
could use some assistance. Secure the protomatter. They just don't know when to quit, do they? Matter secured. Those were traditionalists. I suspect one of their operatives was behind the sabotage here as well. I've locked out access to everyone but you and me. We can make things right without any interference once we return to our ships. Systems are online. We're ready to go. Initiating restoration process now. Protomatter matrix deployed. Everything's in the green. We did it. It worked. Our sensors are showing a stable protomatter matrix in the formation of crops at all production sites. We owe you a profound debt of gratitude. Thank you. Their actions have shamed us all, but they will not get away with it, I assure you. Minister Pentaro is looking into it personally. He has sent some ships to escort you back to New Kentar. Alien vessels! Surrender or be destroyed! Pride, hate, and fear. I wish to formally apologize. 
thank all of you, in person. Under the circumstances, we should meet on one of your vessels. The Rescada. This is a momentous occasion. I'm glad you're here to share it with us. Diplomacy is part of a captain's job, as you know. I hope I'm up for the challenge. Welcome to the Riscava, Prime Minister. I look forward to working together. Thank you, Captain. Most kind of you, after all that's happened. We almost lost everything today. Instead, we can begin to build a better future, thanks to you. There will be resistance from people like Pentaro, but we must continue to look ahead. To that end, we hope to work together with you and your allies. I'm happy to hear it. Kentari and Lucari have lived apart far too long. We've recently begun to explore beyond our world. Perhaps we can do so together. Perhaps. We've got a lot of work to do before then, however. Indeed we do. Well then, let's get started, shall we? Starfleet Intelligence has learned that Martok, the former Chancellor of the Klingon Empire, is alive. 